All right, let's talk about the facts of Senate Rule 19. Of course, Republicans use that rule uh, to silence Elizabeth Warren. In fact, the moment it was invoked, she was not allowed to uh, say anything further when it came to the nomination of Senator Jeff Sessions. Now, here's what's in interesting. The rule says that no senator should speak ill of another senator during the debate. Now, the rule was uh, comes from a situation in 1902 involving this man, South Carolina Senator Benjamin Tillman, who punched fellow Senator John McLaurin after McLaurin called Tillman a malicious liar. That took place on the floor of the Senate. Now, the rule, in essence, protected Tillman, who was an unabashed racist and supporter of lynching. In a speech on the Senate floor in 1900, this is what this racist Bill Ben Tillman said, quote, we of the South have never recognized the right of the Negro to govern white men, and we never will. We have never believed him to be equal to the white man, and we will not submit to his gratifying, to, grat to, to his gratifying his lust on our wives and daughters without lynching him. I wish to God the last one of them was in Africa, and none of them had ever been brought to our shores. In fact, this same racist, Senator Tillman, also condemned Booker T. Washington being invited to the White House by President Roosevelt. In fact, Tillman said that more than a thousand, quote, niggers should be lynched as a result of that particular decision. Folks, that is the basis of Senate Rule 19 to protect a violent racist, South Carolina Senator Tillman, that goes back to 1902. Kickstart your day at 7 and get the news you need from the perspective you want. News One Now with Roland Martin, every weekday morning at 7 on TV One.